hello friends this is going to be a simple video on adding a text view edit text and button in an android app using aid so let's start in aid just create a new android project here i am going to name it as edit text Okay, when we create a new project in AID, it automatically creates a Hello World app which somewhat looks like this, means it contains a linear and a text view. And this linear has a horizontal orientation, so first we will change the orientation of this linear to vertical. And now after this, inside this linear, we will add one edit text field, so just go up and click on add inside then click on text field and add an edit text field now below this we will now add a button so for that click on widget and add a button and below this we will add an text view field so for that click on view and then click on we can select a medium text Okay, and in this app, I will get the contents of edit text field to text view field by clicking the button. And for doing that, we need ID for all these three. So we will create an ID for edit text field. We will make it simple by writing edit one. Then one ID for the button. But one and an id for text view field text one now after this when we go back to the xml file main.xml file you can see that it has already it has already got the contents now we move to the java file in java file here it has imported android.app and android.os and below that it has written public class main activity extends activity. Now inside this we will declare the three widgets which we just added. So for that write private then the first one was edit text. private edit text then its name edit one and a colon semicolon and after this write private button and then but one then in next line private text view which is text one now inside the on create event this is on create event and it starts with this curly bracket and ends with this curly bracket now inside this after set content view we will declare the three widgets means we will find these three widgets edit text button and text view by using this simple code First for edit text, edit one is equal to then in bracket write the type. It is an edit text. This is the type of the field, and after this write find view by ID, and then write r dot ID dot edit one then close the bracket put a semicolon next line write similar thing for the button the type is button here and then write find view by id and inside this r dot id dot but one now close this 
put a semicolon next line for text view text one equal to then text view after this write find view by id then same thing r dot id dot text one now close this bracket and put a semicolon so this will get the fields from xml file now after this we will set a button on click listener means what will happen when button is clicked for that we will write button one but one dot set on click listener and inside this bracket write new then capital from capital one view dot on click listener then this two brackets and after that one curly bracket to start this my next line write at override and then next line public void on click and in bracket write view v then close this bracket and open this another bracket now after this we have to close this but one on click listener so we will put this and then give some space now we can write the contents here means what will happen when the button is clicked but first we will correct this errors these errors are because of this view it cannot find view because it is not imported so here we will import this with this single code import android dot view dot and then a star and then put a semicolon that's all all errors are gone now and now we can write the code about what will happen when button is clicked so we will write it here button one set on click listener and then public void on click now inside this we will get the contents of edit text one and display it as text one so for that we will write text one dot set text and then bracket and close now inside this we can write whatever we want to set as text of text one so here we will get the contents of edit one edit one dot get text and then close this bracket now after that write two and then string and that's all this will get the contents of edit one and set it as text of text one let's check this now okay here you can see the edit text field and button and text view field let's write something and when we click the button it comes to text view so i hope this was useful for you thank you very much for watching this video